It's been 15 years since the 6.7 magnitude Northridge earthquake struck near Los Angeles. It killed 72 people and caused $20 billion in damage. The swarms are right here. Now, seismologists are closely watching a cluster of earthquakes, rattling residents in the desert near California's Salton Sea. A lot of shaking, a lot of shaking going on. More than 450 quakes have hit this area since March 21st, mostly magnitude 3 or lower, but one was a 4.8 shaker. It's very close to the southern end of the lock section of the San Andreas Falls, and anything seismically that happens in that area gets definitely gets our attention. The San Andreas is an 800-mile-long fault line slicing through California from north of San Francisco to the Salton Sea. Scientists say energy is building up in the southern end of the fault. They worry small quakes could act as a trigger. But it's been more than 300 years since a major quake hit this part of the San Andreas Fault. So scientists say this vast stretch of desert may be primed for the big one. A massive quake that could devastate Los Angeles 150 miles away. The government says there is a 99.7% chance that a 6.7 or larger quake will hit California in the next 30 years. They can't predict precisely when or where it will strike, but scientists are adding 22 new motion sensors on the San Andreas to detect seismic activity. And this past fall, California staged the largest earthquake drill in U.S. history. But those who live right on top of the fault say they've been ready for nearly two decades. They've been telling us ever since then, the big one's going to hit in a few days, the big one's going to hit in a few days, and we are still waiting. But waiting is much better than the alternative. Ben Tracy, CBS News, at the Salton Sea.